everybody, Diamond Grandma here with two canvases I have completed from Craft Art Club. Craft Art Club is a low budget friendly website. Uh, they do have great paintings to pick from. I didn't have any issues with either one of these. Um, but anyway, I will provide links down in the description box below so that y'all can go and check them out. I recommend for y'all to go check them out. They are a great budget-friendly website that you can find some great stuff. This first one, y'all, is gorgeous. It is so pretty. It turned out better than I thought it It is around. It was $5.66. It is a 30 by 40 from Craft Art Club. Y'all look at it. Is that not gorgeous? And that that mem wax y'all can see that shine that mem wax y'all is fantastic but here it is so pretty like i say this one was five dollars and 66 cents on craft art club's website i didn't have any issues i had plenty of beads plenty of things left over um this was fun to do it had a good bit of color blocking in it and it did have some confetti too but anyway, I just thought it was gorgeous. It turned out better than I thought it would. I didn't know how it would turn out when I get, you know, when you get some of them and sometimes the colors don't look that vibrant when you unbox them or whatever. But this one is gorgeous. I love it. So pretty. Okay. And this next one, y'all, I am so in love with it. This is an older canvas that I've had for a while that I have finally got around to. This one is a 50 by 40 centimeter. And it was $9.68 on their website. It is a round. And here it is. Oh, this is not cute. I love it. I will be hanging this one up. Y'all know how I am about my chickens. But y'all look at it. It is it not gorgeous. I got this one because I knew it being a uh, 50 by 40 that it should come out looking good. And it does. I love it. Y'all know I love my roosters and my chickens and my farm stuff. These sunflowers. But I just think it's just gorgeous. It took me two days to do this one. But I just think it is gorgeous. So pretty. And I have sealed it in mem wax too. That mem wax, y'all. Good shine. But y'all, this is craft art club like i say i had plenty plenty of um beads left over the stick was good on it didn't have any issues with it y'all know i'll tell you if i have any issues on it the rendering turned out good on this one i mean i know it's a little busy but the rendering did turn out good on it because of the size the bigger the size the better it looks and like i say this is a 50 by 40 and this one was a 30 by 30 and y'all the rendering on this one's good but it's just a simple rendering it ain't nothing just real busy or whatever but it turned out real good too but y'all get on there and check them out i just love them i think they both turned out great y'all know i'm all about doing chickens and stuff and i like colorful stuff too so and i like moons and stars and sunsets and sunrises and everything but yeah I just couldn't get over how good this one looked I was well pleased with it well pleased with it I would not probably have got this one if it was a 30 by 40 but it being a 50 by 40 like I say the rendering's good on it when you get it when you pick out something you know sometimes you have to take a chance on it because I take a chance on a lot of stuff and with the rendering because you know if it's real busy sometimes the rendering is not as good on it but a lot of times the rendering some of the rendering on some of these 30 by 40s will show that the bigger stuff will look real good and the smaller stuff will look kind of fuzzy like faded out and your emphasis is like on the big thing which i like some of them that are like that too um but you just, I mean, you just have to take a chance on stuff. But I wanted to go ahead and get this one done so y'all would know. This one is not very old that I got from them. But y'all, if somebody out there likes doing things like this, or has somebody that likes chickens or roosters or anything like this, this one right here, I laughed because y'all, I had watched when I, uh, 
thought I was going to do it for completion. I watched Jacqueline Carter Smith. <laughs> Jack. And I'll link her channel down below. She was doing a whipping chat. And I will link that whipping chat down below. Uh, about she grew up on a farm, which I did not know that about her. I enjoyed her whipping chat because I learned a lot about her. And she was scared to death of chickens. That was her job was to take care of the chickens. And she was so scared of the chickens, she just didn't like them. And her daddy watched her one day and noticed that she was really scared of them. And they quit making her have to deal with the chickens. But I love this. So pretty. Jacqueline would probably like this one. Jack would because it's not they're not alive. But it's so pretty. She's got a friend, I think, that likes chickens. So, But anyway, this is so cute. And I love it. It'd make a great gift. But I am keeping this one. Y'all know I've got... Mine is done in farm, so this is definitely me, and I loved it. I had so much fun doing it because it had a lot of confetti in it, as y'all can tell right in through here. And this one had color blocking and confetti in it. But even in this chicken right here, there's a little bit of color blocking, but it's got different colors in it. So, but anyway, I will shut up all my rambling. But y'all check them out, Craft Art Club. Like I say, they are low budget. I have done some boxings for them. And I got these two done. And I wanted to get on here and show y'all. So if y'all decide y'all want these, that y'all can look them up and order them. But like I say, this one right here, I've got it wrote on the back. So I'll know this one right here is 566 and it is a 30 by 40. And this one right here, one more time, is a 50 by 40 centimeters. And it was $9.68, which is a good price on this one, y'all. Because y'all know when y'all get over a 30 by 40, they go up. But they do have some good prices on uh, a lot of their uh, items and products and stuff. So y'all get on there and check them out. If you want something like cheaper, low budget, y'all know I push low budget. Y'all know I love low budget. I do like the more expensive stuff too. But I watch how I buy that because I get deals on it all the time. And y'all have been good enough to me to send me some of them through the mail as friend mail. And I appreciate it so much. And, but you feel I, I really love low budget. I do. I love low budget. I love doing them because I do so many of them, you know. I Like I have told y'all, I'm at home during the day. I'm a caregiver for my mother. And I get to do it in between taking care of her. And I set up late at night because... I don't get out to her house very early because she likes to sleep me in because she watches TV at night. And during the day, she is a TV junkie. That's what she likes to do is TV. And I uh, sit over there with my earphones on watching YouTube. And uh, anyway, while she watches TV, if she needs me, she'll wave at me. And of course, I don't keep them on all day long. I talk to her too. So, But anyway... I get to do a lot of them and I love low budget. I just got, I'm gonna tell y'all, this kit right here was great quality. And this one right here was great quality too. You can't beat the quality on a lot of these cheap ones, on the budget friendly ones, cause the quality is just as good as the expensive ones. And to tell you the truth, a lot of times the quality is better on the cheaper ones than they are on the more expensive ones. So, but anyway, I will shut up now and move along. But anyway, y'all get on there and check them out. Craft Art Club. Like I say, Craft Art Club. Check them out. Here they are one more time. Check them out. Get on there. They are low budget. They go easy on your wallet. But y'all get on there and check them out. And if you like what you see, hit the like button. If you would like to be part of the Diamond Grandma family, please join me and hit that little subscription button down there. It'll upload anytime I do a video and I just want to say thanks for stopping by and I love y'all and I hope to see y'all tomorrow. Y'all come back soon.